So uh, let's say, not let's say, I am, I am a real estate investor right here in Eastern North Carolina. So let's say that I want to kickstart and launch my content marketing initiatives, either doing it myself or hiring you and your company to do it. What are some different strategies that could be employed to start using content marketing to where it would be, you know, beneficial? The first thing I would say is, and this is definitely the easiest thing to start with is video content. You know, I I'll have a lot of people say like, yeah, but what about cameras and microphones and how do I script? Like, don't worry about that. Video Starting with video is definitely the easiest way to do this. Um, and the more complex you make it, by the way, the, the worse it's going to be for you. So keep it as simple as you possibly can. That's the name of the game here. Um, but the best thing to do would be to topics wise is you, you want to make sure you're shooting videos and putting content out there that's relevant to what your target demographic is looking for. So your target demographic is a motivated seller. Now, what I would do is categorize those motivated sellers. You have, you know, uh, absentees, you have, you have landlords that have uh, properties that are vacant. Uh, maybe you're doing driving for dollars and you have, you know, some leads for that. You have probates, you have all kinds of different scenarios and different motivations. Categorize what those are. Now, the next step would be to make sure you're creating topics for that. So what are the questions that people in these demographics are asking about selling a house? Take, for instance, uh, you know, somebody that's uh, an, an, an older lady who maybe she's a widow. Um, she's in her late 90s and or early 90s or whatever. And she's just in a stage of life where she can't keep up the house anymore. And she wants to move out. Right. You guys are probably familiar with this kind of scenario. Well, the best thing to do would be to educate that lady on what the next steps would be for her or what the next steps would be to sell the house and how to make it as easy as possible, because that's what's going to be the biggest factor for her. Price may not have anything to do with what she's looking for. Maybe she's had the house for 60 plus years and she, you know, paid it off 20 years ago and had a, you know, dirt cheap, bought it dirt cheap or whatever. So you have a lot of different things that are working towards this. So you have to absolutely ask the questions um, that the sellers are asking the questions. So figure out like, what is Mary, 90 year old Mary, what, what questions is she asking about selling her house? And then you shoot videos on that. Uh, some of the biggest questions, if you, if you actually go to Google keyword search, and you look up, uh, sell my house, that term, sell my house. The next phrases that come up is what is a real estate investor? What are the differences between a real estate investor and a realtor or a real estate agent? These are all things that you should be talking about and putting content out about, because these are the questions that people are going to ask you. So three good strategies for this is number one, anytime you're on the phone with a seller or one of your team members, your acquisitions agent or whatever, anytime they're on a phone with a seller, Every time a seller asks a question, write that down. There's a video topic for you. And then obviously a, another strategy would be for you to go back and think about like, okay, what are some of the more common questions that sellers are asking that I've experienced as well? And then third strategy is obviously to go to the web, go to, you know, answer the public.com or um, Google keyword search and figure out what people are searching in addition to sell my house, not sell your house, sell my house, because they're looking for sell my house. Um, and that, that's the important thing is to figure out what they're asking specifically, put yourself in their shoes. And those are the video topics that you're shooting on. Now, the advantage of doing video is because when you do a video, you can move that into multiple, Jay, that you know that this is my, this is my calling card is that repurposing the content. And now if I shot a four minute video talking about what is a real estate investor, because people don't know what that is, guys, they think it's a suit on wall street or a sleazy slumlord. That's literally like taking advantage of people. Um, and if that's not you, it's your job to relay that to your target demographic. So if I do a four minute video on that topic, well, now I can transcribe that, clean up that transcription, put it into a written SEO rich uh, blog or form or whatever you want to call it, throw that on your website. Now you have a whole nother piece of content that's going to reel people in. And so that's the easiest place to start is with video J and don't overcomplicate it guys. Like use your cell phone. If you have to make sure you're in a good environment, make sure you're in an environment. Maybe you have a house that you have under contract, maybe have that on behind you and then just get it out. Like this is what post-production is for a lot of people, Jay, they worry about like, oh, I got to script the video or I got to make sure that I, you know, get, get it right all the way through. No, you don't like just talk. And then a video editor can come in behind you and clip out any dead space, any screw ups that you have. 
and then put the video together for you and boom, you don't have to worry about anything. So literally just open your phone, hit the record button, talk, stop recording, and then you're good to go. So those are the, that's the easiest way to get started, Jay. Um, and even if people want to use Zoom, that's the easiest way to get started. Don't don't start off with going to Best Buy and buying a four thousand dollar Canon camera. That's you're going to get turned off immediately. You're not going to do it. That's my recommendation. So. so.